choose one, the reason we chose to use Isonine was really the long-term value of what it's going to cost for us to, to live in the home. What is our heating and cooling going to be on a regular recurring basis? We lived in a home that was 25 years old and had a $300 a month uh, heating and cooling bill. And in this area, that's it's outrageous. Uh, and so it was really important to not only have a really warm home, but also to, on a regular basis, to keep our, our long-term costs down. We did look at other, other options. Uh, certainly, we had the option to go with your traditional bat insulation or a bibs insulation type style. Um, in the end, again, we just felt that we were going to get the best performance from the Isonine product because of the way it's delivered and the, the way that it creates the overall envelope and seals the home. I have had a chance to experience Isonine during the construction of the home. Uh, when the Isonine product went in, shortly after that, we started the drywall process. And during the drywall process, you know, they, they mud the walls and, and sometimes they'll put heat in the house so that it dries quicker. Uh, we came into the house um, was the next morning after that had happened. And I looked at my wife and I said, it still feels warm in here. And you know, that's really, when she looked at me and said, yeah, I guess we made the right decision with the Isonine product. I would recommend Isonine, and actually already have recommended Isonine. Um, it's when you come in and you see the product being installed uh, and how it's done, you realize uh, it is a far superior product because it does, you know, all those places where you would have to go and seal uh, after the fact with traditional insulation systems, it does it all at once and it creates, you know, one superior system altogether. Mm -hmm.